Well, hello there, Coffee Time friends. How y'all doing? It's Tupperware time now. So we've had our supper. It was delicious, Mama. You did a wonderful job. Yeah, you did. I, I told y'all wrong, I believe. This set, I thought, was ending tomorrow. But the flyer says the 24th. So let's take it at its word. But we're going to show you anyway. So I'm going to kind of go over this. I've got it on Mama's phone. And I'm going to show you what we have, okay? So here is the set that we're looking at. You can get the all of it together or you can buy it by pieces. So here it is. So this is the plates. You have this little picture. I now back it. in the day, it have been Harvest Gold, I believe. Uh, I can't be sure that it's got the plunger lids, starburst inside. That holds, I'm going to tell you in a minute how much they hold. And then you have this quart and a half, I believe it is, picture. Same kind of deal. Plunger lid, starburst bottom. I'll tell you the size in just a second. So there's that, that, and then you have these four zero bows, which I'll have the starburst lids. Mama loves these because they're so hours, didn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, our internet didn't last forever, did it? But we got a few hours out of it. <laughs> these are easy to open, easy to close, and they are great for leftovers. Oh, uh, wonderful for leftovers. And then you, it's got the one click and done. And then these wonderful plates. I know a lot of y'all raised your children on these little square plates. And you can use these. These are wonderful to put bacon in, put a paper towel on them, uh, use them for, uh, to eat out of, put them in, take them out on the porch, get you a piece of cake, put it on there, take it out on the porch. If it falls off, the wind blows it, you're good. Um, these are a lifesaver. And they come in these beautiful colors. All these are matching colors. So all the sets it is. Now I'm going to tell you some information. Mama, your phone. It just went right off on me, didn't it? Yeah, sir, so your phone don't want to play with me. So you have the 9-ounce tumbler sets, the 12-ounce tumbler set, and the 16-ounce tumbler set. They're all the same. So here is the small blue. This would be the 9-ounce. These are 4 for $13. They're normally 16 these are nine ounces and they do have the lid. They don't have a straw, but they won't spill that way. You have the pink. Well, I guess That's you call rose. this rose fuchsia. This is a light pink and you have the yellow and this is the same in all the colors. Matches the bowls. Matches the bowls and the plates. This is the um, 12 ounce tumblers. They're normally $18 or $15. Same thing, except this is the 12 ounce. And here is your 16 ounce. It's the same. It's $19, normally $22. Now you don't, you get the set. You get the four. So you get four of these size in these colors for $19. This is the 16 ounce ones. You get four 12 ounce ones for $15. And then you get four nine ounce ones for 13. 30% 30 off the tumbler bouquet, one to three. Get it all tumblers bouquet uh, for $39. So if you need them all, they're $39. The pitcher set is a two quart and a, um, let's see. It's a two quart or two liter pitcher and a 1.6 quart. So these two here, you can see them. Let me move you little tumblers. Don't tumble. <laughs> That's what they're called, tumblers. <laughs> That's the two pictures you get. And they're $35. These are wonderful. They got a wonderful handle. They get this extra support up here at the top. These are great. A little bit of orange juice and in them. I like the way the pour spouts made on them. Exactly. So these are thirty nine dollars. You get it. The um, two quart or two liter. This is the two quart and the one point six quart. Two quart, one point six quart. Let's read this tumbler bouquet. Thirty percent off. You get one of three. Get it all tumbler bouquet. Includes a set of four nine ounce tumblers, four 12 ounce um, tumblers, and four 16 ounce tumblers for $39. So all the tumblers. Then the pl the, the pitchers are 35. The five piece bowl set, 
This is four piece bow set, number five on the list. This is four piece bow set. These are 16 ounces. They're $29. They were $35. Then the square luncheon plates are not $10. And they are nine and a half by 24 centimeter plates. All right, Mama, tell them what you like about them. All these details are hard to keep up with, folks. Yes. Sizes and colors and all that stuff. Mama says you do that part, but now, Mama. Yeah. Well, I like these because it does have the ridge, and it's great for kids. You know how kids are kind of push their food off to mm -hmm. the edge or little ones. How can you look at me when you say that? <laughs> You're the only little kid I remember how it was about. <laughs> A lot of y'all raised your kids on this very set. Uh, probably different colors with this very set. Some of them the same colors. And they call these cereal bowls. Mama don't call don't them. Do, I don't. This is an everything bowl. Just, I think they should be called everything. You can eat out of it. You can store in it. You can leave leftovers. They're just wonderful. You can put... Uh, candy in it or stuff for the kids set it on the counter their leads are easy to get off and on and they seal great they're just they a wonderful wonderfully. wonderful size and if you're wanting to know about cabinet size you can take all the lids off put them all and stack them up and they take up hardly any room at all yeah. mama likes these because she'll put her leftovers in them then the next day all she has to do is get them out, and if it's something you have to heat up, she puts it. These are not for microwave, no. but she'll put it out. But when you store it in your cabinet, that's all the room it takes up. That's wonderful. And then, um, but you can heat it up, or if it's something that doesn't have to be heated up, like peaches, and put some cottage cheese in it. Yeah. Um, it's awful easy at the moment. Oh yeah. So that's it, folks. That and I thought they were going off tomorrow because tomorrow is Wednesday, but they say they'll be on through twenty fourth of August or while supplies last. Is that correct, Mom? Uh, that's what it said on there, so I don't know if we've messed it up or if they have or what. Anyhow, but, if you're going to get them, don't wait. But, yeah. But these love this one. Uh, bowls, you can pour your kids cereal or whatever they want, pick it out at night, put that lead on there, get up in the morning, they know what color they picked and the cereal. You save so much time by just setting it there. They get to their spot, take that lid off, you pour the milk, and that's mm -hmm. it's done. You save a lot of time of the morning rushing to get ready for school. They're ideal for that. We also use these if we're doing dredge. And by dredge, I mean you mix up eggs in one, you mix your flour up in one, your cornstarch, your if it's whatever you got. a smaller piece of meat or stuff. Or you whatever. can dredge in these great. I dredged mm -hmm. them the other night yeah. on, while we're doing something. Mm -hmm. These right here, this size, this is wonderful for a single person household or even a double. Um, but what we use these size pitchers for is, say we have a gallon of, of iced tea and mama needs to make more and she's wanting to put it in the yeah. big pitcher. She'll pour it down in one of these to size it down and then she'll have her other pitcher, uh, the big blue one, for the tea. tea. And um, that way you always get something where you put orange juice in these. These are pretty. And if you if you got company over, you're gonna have orange juice. Put your orange juice in this one. Put your milk in this one. Set it on the table. Put it in the refrigerator. Get it cold. Set it on the table. It'll go through breakfast. You can have them instead of trying to do the big gallon jug. Show on the lid before it pours out the spout. I hope you already did it. Yeah, it's got a nice spout. There ain't no missing with that one. And you have this plunger lid. They call it. Y'all remember these from back in the day? Everybody had the orange one? Yeah. And everybody had usually Kool-Aid in it or tea. We kept Kool-Aid in it because <laughs> we said it, Mama and Granny would sit it on the porch and say, here, if you just want some more Kool-Aid, come over here and get it. <laughs> and that you way didn't we could. not have to worry about it breaking. It wasn't going to break. They're, they're break resistant. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> this was on the front porch a lot of times. And you can plunge it down. No bees can get in there or nothing like that. I'm not suggesting you do that. I'll let the kids back in the house, Mama. I would got you in the I wouldn't dare let you ain't running no. out. <laughs> no. One thing about it, back in those days, y'all weren't like sitting in the house under the air conditioner and throwing us outside. It was hot everywhere. Yeah. And we had uh, window fans. And the windows were open, so y'all could hear us, but you just don't want us running out. 
carrying in grass and dirt every time. And mud after it rains. And mud. These are wonderful. These, if you're thinking about just beverages, they will are great for beverages, but you can put M&Ms in these. Put those on your diaper bag. You can put uh, graham crackers in them. You can put uh, peanut butter and crackers in them. These are wonderful containers. Um, we don't drink out of anything that's small very much, but Mama uses this size for other things. Yeah. And I can, if you can see, I've got Mama real short see. fingers. Real short fingers. Kinda. <laughs> and I See, I can't reach all the way around this one. And if you get them too big, then I have a problem if they've got weight in them to lift them up and hold them. And even these biggest ones, I can get my hand around it far enough that I can grip it and hold it. But if you get a wider thing, I cannot pick it up with it full of milk or mm -hmm. juice or anything. I just can't get enough grip around it to hold it if it's real big around. If you're like us and you use a lot of canned cream, or we call it, it's evaporated milk, we call it canned cream. What do you do with that little bit you have left, or that little bit, you can put it in one of these, put it airtight, uh, spill proof right there, put that in your refrigerator. It's a wonderful little cream container. Or if you have, you've had that recipe where it calls for so many ounces of tomato sauce or so many ounces of tomato juice, you can put your remainder in these and put it in the refrigerator. They're wonderful for that. Aren't Great them for drinking and storage. Drinking and storage. So folks, that's what we want to show you tonight on Tupperware. Mama's Tupperware uh, side is out there. Though the next people were saying it wasn't working. It was working for me, um, even when I would go into the posts that I posted. So I don't know what was going on. Sometimes they do take them down for just a minute. Uh, sometimes there's maintenance and they take it down for an hour. So if it is down, just keep trying. It'll be back up. Um, some of y'all have asked us about recruit um, working under Mama as a consultant. It's on Mama's page. All you have to do is go through the link. Uh, there's a they caught the hamburger. It's three little lines up here at the top. Hit that. It'll bring up a menu and it says shop. You hit shop and it'll take you in. You can shop and their categories are current brochure, specials, uh, cookware, storage. All the categories you want to shop individually is there. There's also a catalog. Some of y'all have asked about catalogs. We only get one catalog at a time. We've not got any for the last two months, have we? Uh, yeah. No, I've not got any. The catalog? Not for uh, July. Oh, we yeah. One. Um, we use the one on the line, too, a lot of times. But if you need it, you can uh, get them. But the, the catalog is on there in complete and you can just turn the pages just like you would in a real book it's very neat the way they have it set up but if you want to be a consultant just hit join us and then you can start buying your Tupperware at discount prices and you can start your own business and making your own money um, Tupperware each individual consultant you do have your own business so it's not uh, like some others it is your business and you can work it as much as you want to and you can make as much as you want to depending on how much you work it right mom yeah i'm standing here thinking about filling this full of apple juice and setting it out of the morning to drink it'll be very fresh that would be good. good that would be very good apple juice would go right in there or grape juice or whatever you want to use it for if you don't like to store containers in your refrigerator you have these little ones to go with. Mommy, anything I else you want? I think I need another set of the... <laughs> of these? Of the pictures, yeah. Um, While oh, they're on special. I have ordered another set, just okay. by the way. Well, thank you. Because I thought these would make good gifts. These would make good... When people come over, let them take one home with you. Um, these make good... When the kids come over, we'll have more... Food. You've dropped them twice. We'll have more than four. They're not breakable. I'm just showing y'all that. It's a demonstration. <laughs> demonstration. <laughs> you did it on purpose? Yes, Mama. <laughs> no, I didn't. They've got this lip on them. And when you pick them up like this, they are top heavy and they'll spill right over. Yeah. Um, again. <laughs> again. But if, if you're going to have family reunion or something, this ain't four ain't going to be enough, so i got to do some more. Uh, so these are handy. But they do have that good little lip on. That's the reason I'm dropping them, because of that little, when I flip it like that. You know, when you it. eat cantaloupe or a little piece of cantaloupe or chunks of watermelon, how the 
juice will run out. I could eat ice cream out that. <laughs> I'm that fast. But you can see it's got that little lip. You'll get brain freeze if you eat it too fast. I guess I would. So they're good. Most of y'all have these. Most of y'all have seen these. You think, I know what it's showing. Mm -hmm. Alright, folks, that's it. That's all we have for tonight. Um, we don't do as many Tupperware sh things. Mama does this just for I'm going to have to go check on Maggie. All right. Maggie's in there doing her thing. She did come in to uh, eat or drink while we were eating. That's a little worrisome. I think Mama heard her. Sometimes Maggie sleeps and talks in her sleep. Does your dog talk in her sleep? Maggie does. And, she's, and she runs in her sleep. It's the cutest thing. She'll just run. Um, but she'll... Bar. Mama's heard her making that was. Um, but anyway, this is the Tupperware tonight, and this is what we want to show you. I thought it ended tomorrow night, but the brochure says the 24th. So um, hopefully that's uh, all cor correct. If it didn't, I'll post something different, but I believe it is. Um, but uh, this is a great little set. Pick it up and uh, enjoy it. I love the little picture. This is my favorite one. And this is these are this is not a gallon. This is a two quart, so it's a half gallon. Uh, these are good sizes. Sometimes the big ones are a little bit big. Sometimes even when you fill the big one, once you get it down, you don't want to keep pulling it in and out. Take it out and transfer it into one of these. So there it is, folks. It's all on the site. I will post the link below, and you can go over, click on it, and check it out and uh, enjoy. Mama's. I hear Mama talking to her. Maggie's fine. Uh, anyway, that's the tip of our demo tonight. Thank y'all for joining us for supper tonight, and thank you all for joining us for this. Uh, we appreciate you all. We really do. Mama loves this. Mama is, as you all can see, Mama's a busy, busy person. She's always got something going. She likes to keep a project. She likes to keep something moving all the time. And I can't tell y'all during the worst of COVID, how this really helped Mama out. Uh, just having something to do, something to focus on, something to concentrate on. And the cookbooks has just been a blessing, and you all are a blessing for keep ordering them. And uh, it gives her a full-time job, and she likes it. And uh, the Tupperware, it's a beautiful hobby for her. She loves it. It gives her something to do. And uh, my favorite thing about it is it gives her a circle of friends. She has met more people with Tupperware. Yeah. And it's just a wonderful opportunity. How's the girl? Fine. She's, she's talking in her sleep, wasn't she? Yeah, she does. I told him she talks in her sleep and she runs in her sleep, barks in her sleep. She barks, but it's a funny sounding bark. It's a full, it's a low bark, but you can tell exactly what it is. It's woof, 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 woof. And she runs for miles. And what I like the best, uh, whenever she's running and she's barking, whatever she's chasing and whatever she's doing when she wakes up all of a sudden she looks around for it like <laughs> where, where'd that go uh, and it takes her a minute to realize i guess to me she don't know what a dream is and i guess it seems pretty real to her but if you want to know if dogs can dream or not we got the proof they can because Maggie dreams a lot, doesn't she? Yeah. She'll wake you up a barking and she'll be sound asleep. I tell them, I said, Mama's heard Maggie because I, I heard her too. She's the queen. Speaking of the queen, I got to take her out. Let her spend her time in her domain observing and checking and see if anybody's done anything against her will or while she wasn't watching because she'll go out. It, it's just funny how she lays. It's just funny. She... Do you see those lions that are like at the end of people's driveways and they're laid out and they're like, that's how she lays, just all day. She's nosy. <laughs> Head up, looking around. Anything that goes by, she wants to know all about it. She's she has true. got, well, the UPS man always brings her a biscuit and talks oh, to her. And today, uh, no, it was yesterday, right? and we had a different uh, FedEx driver. Those are your friends, Mom. I don't ever get to see them. No, and uh, he had her a biscuit, and he just talked to her and asked her about her leg, and just and he had a 
something wrong with his leg. He said, little girl, you got something wrong with your leg just like I have mine. <laughs> he just carrying on a conversation. She was eating it up, but she thought he was the best thing. <laughs> she is. It's funny. The, um, the FedEx driver came by my office one day, and he had brought, um, I don't know, I didn't know him, um, and he had brought the package in for one of the workers. And I said, you got anything from me? And he said, what's your address? And I told him, and he said, oh, I know you well. He said, I didn't know you, but I know your mom and I know Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> I said, oh, okay. He said, yeah, I've been to your house quite a lot. He said, I know your mom and I sure know Maggie. I said, well, good. It was just funny. He knew the number and he knew the dog. And the mailman gives her <laughs> a treat too. And one, I was in the garage with the door open. It was on a Friday evening and, and he was saying, I'm sorry, Maggie, I don't have none today. I'll bring you two Monday. And he's just talking, explaining it to her. <laughs> My sister was here and he said, What's he? I said, he's telling Maggie he don't have a treat. And she's just standing there listening and laughing at him. She said, boy, has she, he got her spoiled. <laughs> she gets how he is if she don't get a treat. He said, I'll you got anything you. else, Mama? No, I've talked enough. Mama, you don't ever talk enough. You, you don't yeah. talk much. I talk a lot. You don't yeah. talk much. That's what I had you for, to talk for me. <laughs> Somebody said, John, I thought it was Mama's Tupperware. You do all the talking. Yeah. I said, I do what I'm told. I work for Mama. Mama said. I would have it some mess. Mama said, now, I don't want to get involved in all them numbers, them sizes. You just tell them that part, and I'll, uh. I use it. That's good enough. Yeah. <laughs> You're the type of lady, Mama. Yeah. All right, folks. We're going to say good night this time, because yeah. we won't be back tonight, and uh, we will, Lord willing, we'll be back tomorrow, though. You'll have a blessed night. Sleep well. Wake up in the morning refreshed, renewed, and thank the Lord for being on the wake up list. That's right. And uh, have a great day. Tomorrow's Wednesday. If you have it's to work half Monday, over yeah. If you have to work Monday through Friday, it's half over. Uh, and maybe tomorrow starts your weekend. I don't know, but enjoy whatever it is, because we only have good days, better days, and great days. So have one of those three tomorrow, uh, Mama. Say good night to the folks. Good night, everybody, and God bless you all. Bye bye. Bye, y'all.